channel uh that's right project smurf we are slowly getting things back together got the motor in the car we are addressing some issues uh so let's go ahead and talk about some of the issues that we're addressing i would consider these kind of minor issues uh fuel we're gonna have to move these lines uh header comes in way too close and they're just not in a good location uh the linkage gets really close to this guy here so we have to shorten this a little bit to get this moved over so we can get away from it it's 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 rubbing right on that so when I, I just don't like it so we're going to fix that uh see what else was there that was the two biggest things that i know that we had they had we had issues with most everything else up here to, appears to be in the right location so uh but yeah we have to get the fuel lines moved real quick fix that linkage and uh then we're looking really good once we move the full fuel line i'll be able to get the other header in here and see how it looks in here uh i know when we we're installing it we had to do some trimming here to get the header clear down here and we did the same thing on this side this side we might not have to do it but we cleared it out anyway i don't know if you can see that or not but uh it's right up here so we had to do that hey you can see converter's not in yet because on this block i was missing my dowel pins plus i had to get the dowel pins replaced anyway so no sense of moving more weight than we had to so we still got to get that figured out uh so anyway let's go ahead and uh continue on uh get some of these minor fixes taken care of and hopefully here by the end of this week the motor will be in permanently so anyway uh then we can start addressing the suspension and get all this other stuff in place so uh okay guys it's been a while since i've started this video it's probably been a couple weeks um it's been a good at least week week and a half since i started getting all this stuff set up and trying to fix these little issues and stuff like that i mean I got the fuel line all routed we kind of routed it differently uh but yeah no i've been uh mainly working on the gas tank i you should already seen that video if you haven't go ahead and click up here in the link you'll see how i installed that new gas tank back there uh but then i took some time off uh, i've been cold and been busy doing other things so i was just kind of paused on the uh camera anyway we'll be getting really close getting this motor finally into the car um what can i say um hopefully we'll get this sucker primed up here in the next uh day or so then once i get the oil primed up i'm gonna go ahead and get the spark plugs on get a whole go ahead and address this whole thing and i'm actually going to put it in the car permanently so uh so yeah so still got a lot more work to do but uh it is what it is um i'm gonna go ahead and end this video right now then the next video that you'll see you'll actually see this motor hopefully in the car and should be on the verge of hopefully getting the, getting it started and all that stuff but i'm um, not counting on that in that video but it's going to be really close uh at least a whole suspension beyond so we can actually push this thing and push it out and all that stuff exactly that's what the cat said so anyway uh with that man uh links subscribe share hope you're enjoying this video uh it is the winter time here even though it feels like good springtime weather it's probably in the 60s out there. So anyway, with that, uh, I'm out of here until the next one.